Hi, Margie Bird. Welcome back, guys. I hope you all are doing well. It's 8.08 on the clock, okay? You guys could be seeing those synchronicities. Let's see what's going on with you all. I hope you guys had a good Sunday. Okay, let's tap into your energy, Virgo. Spirit guides, angels, ancestors, ascended masters, gods and goddesses. Please return any spell work, any dark magic that is sent to harm the collective and their loved ones. Me and my loved ones return it back to the sender. What's going on here for Virgo? What are the messages for Virgo spirit? Allow me to be the channel here for my Virgo collective. Let's see. What's going on, Virgo? Messages for Virgo. Okay, so Savage came out in reverse, acting ruthless and considerate of others. No fucks given. Hmm. So that's good. That's in reverse. <laughs> Let's see. What else? Salty, feeling wrong, bitter, and dramatic. Jealousy. Hmm. No filter. Authentic. It is what it is. Sugar free and blunt. And then we have keeping it 100. Honesty, showing true colors, transparent intentions. Bottom of the deck is graduation day. Leveling up, lesson learned, and acquired wisdom. My boo. Okay, I gotta figure. So I feel like Virgo, somebody here is taking up for you. <laughs> okay, whoever this is. I feel like they're standing up for you, honey. To whoever this jealous ass person is. I feel like it's because, too, whoever this is, is trying to change their behavior. They're trying to change their ways. Somebody is, like, growing and maturing and really, you know, standing in their true, authentic self is what, I'm, what it's giving. Um, Let's see. I feel like somebody wants to make it known to you their intentions. But somebody else don't like it. I'm getting like third party. Let's see. What is Savage in reverse? What's Savage in reverse spirit? Okay, so we got spirit gods. The Spirit Guys card and the Six of Cups. So you could be dealing with a Scorpio. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody Spirit Guys is on their ass, period. Yeah, the world and the Will of Fortune. Yeah, something has been, a lesson has been learned here. A major lesson has been learned. And I feel like a cycle is closing out, okay? Somebody here could be moving. Someone could be destined to move to a particular, like, place. Or you feel called to a particular place or something like that. Um, so the will is turning here in your favor. But somebody's spirit guys is not playing. This could be somebody from your past. <laughs> somebody from your past that could have been very immature, very childish. I feel like you and this person could have had a good time together though. <laughs> like, I don't know. Maybe y'all connected when you were like a little bit younger or you weren't as mature as you are now. Or something like that. You got a past life connection with this person. Yeah, eight of wands. So here they come. This could be a karmic here, a karmic from your past that you've that's been a catalyst for your growth here. Some of y'all could have kids with this person. Don't have to be. What's the spirit guys card? Three of Swords. Libra Saturn. Yeah. Something here, for some of you, there's been a breakup or there's been some sort of heartbreaking situation. Okay, somebody here could have just had a baby and it's just like time to mature. Okay, it's time to grow up here. Or somebody could be pregnant. Okay, but the Three of Swords is definitely a breakup. I feel like this was a divinely guided breakup. Whatever this is right here. Spirit orchestrated this. <laughs> yeah, the Empress trust the message, your person. Yeah, Spirit, excuse, ooh, excuse me, is trying to get somebody to see that you're their person. You could be the Empress, Taurus, Libra, okay? 
spirit is trying to show this person or whoever this, excuse me, damn. Whoever this is that you're their person, they have to change. Spirit is on this person's ass, okay? It's like change your behavior or get left, <laughs> okay? Period. What's the Six of Cups? Because <laughs> that's what I'm getting with this. What's the Six of Cups here? This person could be like naive or some or gullible or they just don't have much experience with relationships or just, I don't know. But the Four of Cups... Yeah, something is out of stalemate until somebody grows up. Until somebody grows up and matures here. Something is out of stalemate. I feel like somebody here has had to lose you. So you you could have walked away from somebody and rejected their offer or something like that. That could be triggering this person or whatever. Shit, y'all could trigger each other. Each other. Someone could have a cancer moon. Mm. Four Cups talks about somebody like being self-absorbed. I feel like there's nostalgia too. Somebody misses you. They think about you a lot. Four Cups is too. is like yearning for someone or... I don't know. Somebody misses you here. Mm. So they could have just broken up with someone. Yeah, Two of Cups. Oh, Virgo, this person, this person in love with you. Two of Cups, the Soul Tribe card, and the Six of Swords. So I feel like something is being guided towards you. Somebody is coming towards you. Okay. I know y'all don't like hearing it, but I like cute, little cute relationships. I don't know. It might not be too cute. Yeah, trust the message. The Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, they're coming slow as hell. The Hierophant, though. Could be dealing with a Taurus, a Virgo, another Virgo. Some Somebody coming towards you. They would change behavior, child. They they ain't acting savage, or if they was savage or living some sort of lifestyle, that shit is over. Somebody could be rejecting someone from their past to somebody that they got kids with. <laughs> What's salty? Feeling wrong, bitter, and dramatic, jealousy, the fool. <laughs> I feel like somebody does not give a fuck at all. Could be dealing with the Aquarius. What's salty here with the fool? <laughs> yeah, this, this person got their middle finger up here. <laughs> uh, what's salty with the fool? I cannot. The page of wands. Yeah, somebody is like carefree. They excited for this new beginning. Whoever the fuck this is, you or your person. So the fool is like definitely a new beginning. There's like a leap of faith. Somebody getting ready to take a risk. There could be some sort of like communication to coming towards you. Okay. <laughs> Three of Pentacles, Ace of Swords, Nine of Cups. Yeah. Let's see what's uh what's the page of wands right here. Somebody is like. Free as a fucking bird. They don't give a fuck about who mad. What's the page of wands? Y'all funny, Virgo. Two of cups. Oh, Virgo. This is so cute. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. This is so freaking cute. Yeah, two of wands and ten of fucking pentacles. Ooh, y'all about to get married. Somebody is planning a wedding, child. Two of wands, ten of pentacles. Okay, or this this gonna turn into that. Yeah, the sun, the judgment, the lovers, the just something beautiful is being resurrected. I'm sorry. I know y'all don't be liking to hear all that, but this is for the ones that have this kind of connection. You know who I'm talking about. You know who I'm talking about. Someone can have a cancer Venus. Something is being resurrected here. I don't know. What's the fool? <laughs> What's the fool? Somebody from someone's past is being rejected. Okay, yeah. <laughs> this queen of cups. The queen of cups in reverse. Who is this? Cancer Pisces Scorpio. Could be a cancer. Or somebody with cancer in their chart. Whoever this is is so mad that you do not give a fuck. You're breaking free of them. Or your person is doing this. This is somebody that has like attachment issues. Somebody is very needy. They're clingy. This could be someone that's like very vindictive too, very spiteful with the Queen of Cups in reverse. So, <laughs> somebody does not give a fuck. <laughs> okay, period. Because somebody, somebody's childish. Whoever this Queen of Cups is, is emotionally immature. They're very emotionally immature. 8.18 on the clock. 
child. Let's see what's authentic. <laughs> Y'all are funny. This really <laughs> what's authentic? I mean, what's no filter? This reading is very straight to the point. Yeah, five of wands. Somebody is so mad. What's no filter with the five of wands, the seven of swords? <laughs> I feel like somebody is like, they don't want to be detected, so they're moving quietly. And someone is so mad about that. Somebody's in competition with you. Whoever this is, if they're leaving behind for some of you, they say baby mama, baby daddy, or whoever the fuck this is, a jealous mother. I don't know. But someone is like mad. They want to fight. <laughs> You just gotta laugh at these bitches, Virgo. <laughs> you just gotta laugh because they're they're hilarious. Okay, like they funny. <laughs> they're a bunch of jokes. Yeah, three of pentacles, your person, and the five of swords. Eight of pentacles, five of pentacles, queen of wands, the moon. <laughs> Let's see. Somebody here just likes to fight here. Whoever this is, somebody sits back and plans an argument just to fight. But it's because somebody is like not telling them all their business. Someone is like left out of the loop here. What's the five of wands? It's not your fucking business. What's the five of wands? Child by the king of pentacles, Taurus, and the six of pentacles, Taurus moon. <laughs> Virgo, I cannot. The Emperor, the High Priestess, the Three of Wands. This is masculine here, Four of Wands. For some of you, this is a twin. Oh, this is so cute, Virgo. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. This for some of you, some of y'all could be moving though. You could be traveling. Okay, not everybody got a twin, but so you could be traveling. Okay, moving. All right, you definitely moving here. Uh, this person is listening to their intuition. The Emperor, the High Priestess, and the Three of Wands. Somebody is not. And they moving real quiet too. Somebody is not loud at all. At all here. So there could be fights and shit about money, stability. Somebody could need some money. All right. The King of Pentacles is a provider, a protector, someone that's a supporter, okay, an investor, a great businessman or businesswoman. For some of you, this could be this could be somebody too. Your person's ex, they work where you work or some weird shit like that. I don't know. They could work at the same place that you work and they, they're in competition with what you do for work for some of you. But I feel like this is your person. They could they could have their shit together. But the King of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles, somebody getting paid real good here. <laughs> and I feel like everything now is balanced. So this person is mad because they don't want structure. They don't want balance. They want one. They want shit to be one side. Whoever this is is entitled. They, they feel like they're entitled to your, your finances or your persons. I feel like they can need help, so they fight and they mad. I feel like your person or you, but not neither one of y'all give a fuck, really. Neither one of y'all cares, like, at all. What's the Seven of Swords, child? <laughs> yeah, Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Something is repetitive, it's boring. For some of you, this is like somebody trying to ruin someone's reputation and lying and shit. And they mad because it's lie. It's not holding no weight. Okay. Somebody's childish child. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah. And this is you. Getting your life in balance. Moving forward. I see the goddamn Ten of Pentacles. The Two of Wands. And the Ten of Cups. Virgo. Something beautiful is coming in. I swear. Something beautiful. It's, it's meant to happen too. Trust the message here with the Empress. Something nice is coming, bro. Ten, you guys can be seeing 10, 10. Something definitely is over. Eight of Wands, I'm telling you, it's about to come in. Whatever this is. This is like planning for the future here. This is a beautiful, like, uh, I was going to say reunion. For some of you, it is a reunion. But for others of you, I don't know. You're going to meet like you're happily ever after here. Somebody that you're meant to get married to. Have a bit, like, own a business with. I don't know. This is some building a legacy and building an empire type shit with somebody and somebody is mad oh well bitch <laughs> oh well yeah the emperor i'm telling you whoever this divine masculine is the temperance Ooh, virgo Ooh wee let's see so the eight of pentacles yeah something is not working somebody here could be whoever this is is a scam artist they could be fucked up financially they could be having to go bankrupt and shit 
These could be multiple people too fighting and arguing. <laughs> Child. The Four of Wands, the Tower. The Ace of Cups behind that. Five of Pentacles, the Empress. <laughs> Someone could have an Aries Venus here. This could be an Aries. Or you could have that in your chart. I feel like if, for some of you, the reason why this hoe is fighting over money is because they could have a home here, but they can't pay the bills. Somebody here was supporting this person. And now whoever they living with, I, I don't know. It's like now that none of them can pay the bills here. So this shit going to fall apart. Four of Wands with the tower. For others of you, there's like a surprise reunion. I keep get, I, I get that for y'all. It's a surprise reunion here. I feel like this is a good tower. Some of y'all could be all of a sudden like leaving a home situation. There could be a marriage here falling apart. Like, because it's not meant to be. Child, what the hell? What's keeping it 100? Honesty, showing true colors, transparent intentions. The Eight of Wands. You guys can be seeing 888 in the page. So, ooh, somebody getting ready to communicate, honey. <laughs> somebody. Somebody getting ready to communicate. Could be an air sign. Crazy for Gemini. Could be, yeah, look at their ass. Could be an Aquarius specifically. Yeah, crazy for Gemini. Ace of Swords, Ace of, I mean, Ace of Swords, King of Swords. Child, somebody is coming. This could be like delayed communication coming through. Somebody could be watching you. They planning. Virgo, I don't know. I like this energy. It could have been some bullshit in the past, but honey, I don't know. Some shit just meant to be, child. I don't know what to say. Some of y'all can have some makeup sex here. <laughs> Virgo, Virgo, Virgo. Mm, somebody here watching you. They is what? Let's see. What's uh? What's the eight of wands about? This person, y'all can live at a distance from each other too. Yeah, page of cups. King of Cups, look at you. Oh, that's your masculine. But this could be their karmic though. This Queen of Cups right here. This person has made a lot of changes, honey. Yeah, they've been moving slow. Knight of Pentacles. But honey, slow and steady wins the race. Knight of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, Six of Wands. <laughs> oh. oh, this is nice. I don't know. What's the Eight of Wands? What's the Eight of Wands here? Page of Cups, King of Cups. They coming. They coming. <laughs> I don't know. They coming to express their feelings. I love love. This is so nice. I don't give a fuck who this karmic is. Fuck them. Something is something is literally written in the stars here. Justice. Like I said, a child and the ten of cups. I can the, the hierophant. I don't know. I don't know, Virgo. I don't know what happened in the past between y'all two, but honey, fuck all that. Now, I can't say that for everybody, but there is a beautiful commitment. And it's it's God-ordained here, okay? Like, it's just meant to be. I don't know. Some of y'all know who I'm talking about. It's a pinnacle. Some of y'all, this could be new, right? Don't fuck it up. For others of you, this is somebody from your past. Mm -mm. somebody's getting ready to like express themselves this is someone that really has deep feelings for you they could be they, they really admire you here with the page of cups they could be shy or just like very timid they could be shit we went from the king of cups to the page the page of cups to the king of cups somebody emotionally matured literally for some of you this person could have a child already what's the page of swords the Six of Wands, child, they coming in for a victory. For some of you, y'all could be seen in a public eye. You could get a lot of attention, but this person is rushing towards you. Whoever this is is a part of your soul tribe, and they coming to give you that dangling. Okay, they coming to lay it on you. Because I feel like, I don't know. This connection is so beautiful, honey. This is very short and simple and sweet and to the point. Let's see what happened. Or let's pull some uh, evolution of the soul cards. Somebody's going to speak their truth here with the Page of Swords. <laughs> um, This is like someone speaking up. There could have been some sort of, yeah, with the justice coming out that I saw. There could have been some sort of like injustice here that somebody wants to speak about. 
Okay, not right now. I don't know, but someone here is... I'm really not getting no bad energy. Y'all know I'm good at reading energy. I'll be able to tell you if it's bad. I really don't feel like this off this person. <laughs> I, I don't know. For some of you guys, you're moving on from someone and you're starting brand new. Like this could be somebody new coming in for some of you, right? What's going on here for Virgo? And you're meeting somebody new. Somebody is getting ready to like, they get ready to publicly show you that they got feelings for you. Like, I don't know. What's uh what's what's this for Virgo? Authentic living. Yeah, being true to yourself is important. Inspire others to live authentically. You value honesty and openness. Yeah, and this is what this person is coming to do to open up to you. The page of cups is somebody that's open hearted. <laughs> Okay. What else? Responsibility in reverse. Okay. Taking responsibility for your life, seeing your own faults, owning up to your mistakes. So somebody here is coming in with that justice that I saw. Somebody is coming in to take accountability for something. That's what I was feeling too. Like it's something that they did. They did something. Now we can't, you know what I'm saying? They did something. Life path number nine, somebody could have wise, giving, humanitarian, humble, have vision and passion to inspire others, prone to rescuing partners. <laughs> yeah, they, they try to save somebody. I'm hearing that. Yeah, Aquarius, I'm doing Aquarius next. So you could be dealing with Aquarius for some of you. Community, yeah, in reverse. Making a community contribution, standing up for the rights of others, deeply caring for social issues. Yeah, somebody here doesn't give a fuck about this community. <laughs> There's a community possibly of people that somebody is leaving behind. They're learning how to stay balanced. Yeah, I feel like somebody could have been a people pleaser or overextending or putting other people before their own fucking needs here. Creative, an inborn tendency for creativity. Finding your creative passion, making a living as a creative. Whoever this person is, is very creative. <laughs> what else? Somebody could be bringing you some sort of gift. Criminal mind here. It says prison or jail time, illegal activities, helping criminals change, tested to conquer your demons. Mm -hmm. stardom <laughs> yeah some of y'all are seen in the public eye achieving a high social status famous in entertainment social media famous yeah somebody is definitely seen in the public eye and they live authentically though i feel like this person had you misconstrued <laughs> maybe they they see like people that's probably in the public eye because that's a stereotypical thing people that are in the public eye they really don't live like that like they really not cut like what they show but you, you are. <laughs> like, you are, clearly. Okay, yeah. Let's see. Okay, draconian in reverse. Money hungry and manipulative, adept at fitting in like a chameleon. Can unite people to work together? Somebody is irresponsible here with responsibility and draconian in reverse. For some of you, somebody married this person or this person married a karmic. All right, and this person, this karmic here is irresponsible. Like they were trying to avoid putting in the work here and actually working to make their own fucking money. I feel like they were using this person for money or using you for money, however it's going, but they married the wrong person. This person, they can't even take care of them fucking selves. So what else? That's why they fighting this shit because they need money, <laughs> bitch. Yeah, unconscious. Get your ass on somewhere. What else? Lone wolf, solitude will be your greatest ally. Living a meaningful life as a loner, road to success will be lonely. Period. And that's okay. <laughs> that is okay. Find peace with being by yourself because it's, it's hella peaceful. <laughs> like, shit. I don't know. Loner. Yeah, again. Intelligent, intuitive, analytical. A brilliant mind and unique views won't settle for just anybody. Period. Yeah, somebody is getting rid of this community. I'm hearing community... Okay, I'm not going to say what I was going to say. But yeah. I feel 
feel like that's you too. You're not settling. I feel like this person is learning to stop doing that shit too because it's gotten to nowhere. What else? Inner child. Healing unresolved childhood scars. Childhood trauma holding you back. Exploring your childhood wounds. Yeah. And in the midst of all that, somebody has found their, their passion. A creative spark here. Because whoever this is, it is very artistic. King of Cups, Page of Cups. They're very creative. What else? Marriage. <laughs> a marriage meant to elevate your soul. You will marry in this lifetime. Experiencing oneness in marriage. Aww. Somebody could have married a damn criminal. That was doing some shit. Doing some illegal shit here. What's criminal mind? Level two consciousness, identifying less with materialism, beginning to look inward, spending more time alone and lessons. Yeah. Yep. Whoever this was, they was doing something illegal to make money. And I feel like they got with somebody at yeah, breaking contract. They got with somebody here that um almost got their ass in trouble. Or they did. For some of you, this person even went to jail behind this damn karmic child. Whatever it is. But this is your boo. I don't, look, I don't know. Don't give me the line. But somebody learned their lesson. I don't know. Something happened. Yeah, my boo honeymooning and laid up. I miss you. Oh, this says official status, exclusive relationship. Seeing each other openly. Yeah, somebody getting ready to make it known. They do not give a fuck. Honeymooning, love on the brain, talking often, feeling all the feels. Laid up, cuddle session, intimate moments, escaping the world together. And I miss you. Yearning, missing someone, reminiscing vacation for some of you somebody coming to see your ass they definitely coming to see you here <laughs> oh Virgo, that's cute i don't know i know y'all probably like i don't want them da, 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 da. well this ain't for you shit because i feel like this is right from someone past honey you already know this person for others of you it could be new shit flip it switch it but i ain't seen no ace of cups here i ain't seen nothing new <laughs> just be real so this was your reading. I'm so happy for y'all. Well, for us. Y'all know I'm a rising, so I'm taking it all in. So cute. <laughs> but this was your reading, guys. I hope that this resonated for you. Like, comment, subscribe. Turn your notification bell on. Press the all button so you won't miss any of my readings. And I will talk to you all later. Bye.